Hello there, welcome back to the channel. So are you using an iPhone and you have just upgraded your iPhone to the iOS 16? And right after that, are you having a problem with your camera? Well, a lot of people out there just have upgraded their iPhone to the iOS 16 and right after that, they are experiencing some problem on their camera, such as the camera application keep crashing, camera application getting blur, every time they just try to take pictures, application goes missing, well, autofocus not working, or maybe camera only shows the black screen for their front camera and their back camera. Camera. If you have any of this problem which you mentioned right here, don't worry, just relax and let me go ahead and show you an easy way to solve your problem. Alright guys, now before you go ahead and do anything here, first be sure to check out your lens. Sometimes if your front camera lens or the back camera lens, if it has the dust and particle, then you can have this problem. So make sure to clean it up and at the same time, if that doesn't help, go ahead and remove your lens protector and see what happens. If nothing helps, go ahead and check out our next process. Just simply press the power button and the volume down button and quickly press and hold your power button and keep it holding unless you see your device get restarted. Alright guys, now let's just say you have just did the force restart but still you have a problem with your camera now you might ask what else can you do in the next process you want to open up your settings on your iphone here and scroll down to your screen time tap on there scroll down again and tap on content and privacy restriction first tap on allowed apps and simply enter your screen time passcode over there well now you want to find out your camera especially when you can't find your camera application on your iphone well if you enable this option or features instantly you're going to get back your camera application your camera application is going to get started working. However though, for safety purpose, you can come over here, get back here, then go ahead and turn off the content and privacy restriction for your camera and get out of here and check your problem whether it is still available or not. Now let's go ahead and talk about the camera access for a certain application. Sometimes you can have a problem with a specific application like your Facebook Messenger, Telegram, WhatsApp or any other social media then you might have a problem with your camera. Now let's say you have a problem with this application here then all you want to do here you want to tap on our settings on our device here and scroll down there and now you want to find out the application that you're having problem with. Now for me, I'll just go ahead and open up my Instagram for example, I can tap on there and now you have to check out your camera option from there. If you see it's not toggled on and turned off just like that, enable that and now check your problem. Let's say you still have problem and you can't even use your iPhone's camera. Now what else can you do, right? In the next process, I'm going to talk about the new software update for your device. Now just tap on your settings here, scroll down here and tap on general and now you need to just go ahead and tap on software update. Even though you have just upgraded your iPhone to iOS 16, now if you have the problem because of the software, then with the new software version you actually can solve your problem. If you get a new software update just like that go ahead and update it and after that check your problem well even upgrading your software to the latest software version now there's your last two things that you guys can do if you still have problem with your iphone's camera first open up your settings scroll down to your general and then scroll down again and tap on transfer or reset iphone now go ahead and tap on reset and now just tap on reset all settings now, if it asks you for a screen time passcode, drop it right there, tap on reset all settings, do it again. Now your iPhone is gonna take a restart and your problem is going to be solved. Now let's talk about the one last way. Now, if you still have a problem, that could mean you got a problem with your hardware. Now to solve your hardware problem, you need to take your iPhone to the Apple Care. Hopefully they'll solve your problem. After that, your iPhone's camera will be up and running. Hope you find this video useful. If you think so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you later. Peace out.